Ready. Ready. Right, so here we are, the MMA leader back in London, England. It's amazing to think back to UFC 75 when the UFC first came to the UK. Now you're talking about 25 shows in the United Kingdom, but few markets as rabid about mixed martial arts as well. And the moment you saw guys like Michael Bisping start to fight in the UFC, he seemed as though he was alone. Now there are many, a number of English fighters who dream of headlining this arena. Timely defense there, huge block for him. Just misses with the left hook. Stuffs the takedown there. How good is his takedown defense? All the time. And there comes the separation now. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by the count. Big ball punch lands. Now he gets back to range. Oh, stuffs the takedown without issue. All right, so both fighters now sort of struggling for position here in the clinch. When you find yourself in this situation, what do you do to get out of it? Level. And a nice job to stick with it there to complete the takedown. Oh, big combination of ground and pound strikes here, DC. This could be the beginning of the end. I mean, you gotta be very careful when you take these big ground and pound strikes. You need a control posture on the bottom, and if you're the top guy, the guy that's looking to finish, continue to gain posture and rain down big strikes on your opponent. That knee might have landed there. Stuffs the takedown, no problem. Oh, spinning back fist. He didn't telegraph that one at all. Back and forth we go. Connects now with the one-two. Man, he has a great double leg. My goodness, he has a great double leg. Lands with the kick there. No pad on that foot. No shin guard. He's taking all of that kick every time he goes. All right, he engages in a single collar tie here. Cut them down the side with a beautiful leg kick. And yet another takedown by Formiga. Well, you know, I don't like the gi very much, but I have an appreciation and a healthy one for these type of transitions. You can tell he's been in the gi at some point in his life because he didn't move so freely. I'm skipping jujitsu next week, too. <laughs> beautiful body kick. Stuff to take down, no problem. I mean, this guy is really focused on those punches to the head inside of the clinch. Well, he continues to find the openings tonight. Quick entry to get Man, in on a single. Was a great single. Oh. Nice big takedown. What a technique. What a takedown. Great high impact skill. You could feel the canvas reverberating here at the bottom. I mean, right there. Boom, 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 boom. <laughs> it's like me running anywhere, John. <laughs> and they both stand up. Miss with that jab attempt there. Look at the whip action that comes from him throwing that kick. Look at how he turns his hip into that leg kick. He blocks the punch. Oh! He's hurt. Throws him up. Go get him. Trying to stay in this fight. No! Oh, oh, big left hook there. Starting to do some really significant damage to the body here. Another strike lands there. Oh, a little single collar tie there. And a nice job at least staying upright on that. Oh, huge block! Look at him chopping the wood. Chop the wood with those leg kicks. All right, he engages in the single collar tie. That's a big strike right there. the feet now. Oh, single collar tie here. Oh, that's a good right hand. Stuffs that takedown attempt without issue. Great single entry, rotates the ball. Oh, 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 oh. 
All right, so he's sort of turtled up here. Not great body language. Perhaps oh. he's trying to bait him in a little bit. Round two straight ahead. All right, so we now look back at some of the action from that previous round, DC. A lot of good highlights on both sides. I mean, a lot of good highlights from both competitors. They both should be very proud of what they accomplished. But I'm telling you, man, I'm not sure they can keep this up. If they land at this clip for another five minutes, somebody's going to sleep. You ready to fight? Ready. All right, here we go with round two. Oh, he connects there. His hands look good to him. So fast. I mean, this guy has tremendous hand speed. It's very tricky when he throws that body. Oh, continuing to work the body to great effect. A single collar tie. Takedown defense holds up. He's in a good flow right now. He's landing big shots to the body. Just misses there with the left. He's throwing every part of himself into these big leg kicks. Oh, man. Oh! Formiga's lower jaw now starting to show signs of swelling. And he connects there, DC. Great job landing that one. Well, he has certainly found the range and staying pretty busy here on the field. He's being busy, but it's also the timing and the accuracy that's allowing him to land so many attacks. And there's another takedown attempt. Just misses with the left hook. Right hand puts the clinch. How about that chin? All right, so he lands a jab there. Pretty nicely done, DC. You can really control the fight. Just know how to fight behind your jab. So he's landed some good shots tonight, but this is not a combo meal, right? No three-piece, no solo. It's one and done. Right the night. John, don't you come with me without a combo. I want the whole platter. Give him the whole platter, young man. Put some punches together. Make this guy take the whole thing. Give him more than one strike. You have now found a set of punch. The jab is landing consistently. Find something that's going to go behind it. Here, continuing to try to get a more dominant position in the clear. He just stopped looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. So, a much different approach from him here in round two. Took him a while to find the range, get in his striking rhythm. He has found it here and, as a result, has really picked up the pace in round two. Nice kick there by an ever improving Juicy A for me. Leg kick. Big punch land. Stuffs the takedown there. How good is his takedown defense? He's got a serious right punch, and he went to it effectively there. It is his money shot. He will continue to throw it until he finds a knockout. Well, you got to think he's going to enjoy watching this one back tomorrow morning. He has landed a ton of significant strikes, and. Really, a guy who has been a monster in the gym finally putting it together here in the octagon. To go home and admire your work, it doesn't take till the next morning. He's going back to <laughs> right now to fire up the video to look at beauty in action. And he was the one causing all the action. All right, single collar tie now. Oh, stuffs the takedown without issue. All right, some really cool work here in the clinch. Both fighters really struggling to gain a dominant position. That happens whenever you understand the position. Both know exactly what they need to do. Oh, level change. Nice trick to get the takedown. Fighters back to their feet here. Nice punch land over the top. He closes the distance, gets the single collar tie. Quick entry here. Nice single leg entry. Rotates ahead outside to a high box. He flips him over the top. What a huge takedown. I mean, do I see?
survive that, or did I read my last one? Absolutely not. You don't survive that. It's over. It's over, John. And he's looking for that left hand, just missed. Right hook attempt, that's a miss. 20 seconds left. I'm gonna struggle here now for position in the clinch. from this one. This was a fight that had it all, and for my money, his best performance to date. His best performance to date in the biggest moment. In the biggest moments, you gotta show up, and that's exactly what he did tonight. He used every bit of his skill to get the job done. The decision is inside the octagon. It resides with Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean has called a stop to this contest at four minutes, 54 seconds of round number two. Declaring the winner by knockout, Alejandro the Cannibal Pantoja. All right, so there he is, the man of the moment celebrating.